The Nigerian Air Force, NAV, has announced the shooting down of one of its fighter jets by bandits in Zamfara State, but disclosed that the pilot was rescued. Air Commodore Edward Gapwet, Director of Public Relations and Information, Nigerian Air Force, said in a statement on Monday morning, July 19, 2021. On 18 July 2021, at about 12.45 p.m., a Nigerian Air Force NAF Alpha Jet aircraft returning from a successful air interdiction mission between the boundaries of Zamfara and Kaduna states came under intense enemy fire which led to its crash in Zamfara state. Luckily, the gallant pilot of the aircraft, Flight Lieutenant Abayomi Dairo, successfully ejected from the aircraft. Using his survival instinct, the pilot, who came under intense ground fire from the bandits, was able to evade them and sought refuge in nearby settlement awaiting sunset. Using the cover of darkness and his phone set for navigation, Flight Lieutenant Dairo was able to elude several bandit strongholds and maneuvered his way to a Nigerian army unit where he was finally rescued. It is instructive to note that upon receipt of the news of the crash, the Chief of Air Staff, Air Marshal Oladayo Amau, had directed that all efforts must be in place to rescue the pilots. Accordingly, NAF Intelligence Surveillance Reconnaissance ISR platforms and helicopter gunships provided close air support to NAF Special Forces and Nigerian Army troops who were able to locate the crash site and the pilot's parachute, while also combing nearby locations for any sign of the pilot. It is gladdening to note that while in hiding, Flight Lieutenant Dairo confirmed that the presence of NAF aircraft within the vicinity of the crash site helped in scaring the bandits who were after him, thus enabling him to find refuge and escape to a safe location. It is important to also recall that only recently, the President, Commander-in-Chief of the Armed Forces of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, President Muhammad Buhari, GCFR, had directed the Armed Forces of Nigeria to do all it takes to flush out criminal elements in Katsina, Zamfara and Kaduna states. It is in fulfillment of this directive that the NAF, in conjunction with surface forces, has in the last two weeks mounted intensive day and night interdiction operations against bandits and their hideouts, especially in these three states. Through these intensive air operations, hundreds of bandits have been neutralized and several of their hideouts destroyed. Despite the setback of yesterday's crash, the NAF remains committed towards fulfilling Mr. President's mandate as well as other constitutional rules assigned to it. The willingness, readiness, and tested ability of the NAV remains unshaken and unwavering as it continues to carry out its assigned roles. From Lagos, this is Tina Timothy, News Express Nigeria Television.